my name is Mary, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to publish your website and also adjust a few privacy settings in Adobe Portfolio. So now that I have my basic website ready and complete, I might be ready to publish it so that others can also view it. To publish my website, I'm going to click this green button down here in the left-hand toolbar. It may say publish site or update live site, depending on if I've already published my site previously. If you make any changes after your website has already been published and you would like to update your website with those changes, you will click the update live site button. And then from here, you can either view your live site or go back to the editor to continue editing. If you would like to unpublish your website, you can do so at any time by clicking settings in the left hand panel and then click on unpublish site. If you would like to make your entire website private, you can do so pretty easily by also adding a site wide password. To do so, I'm going to do the same exact thing, go to settings on the left hand panel and then select password protection. Now, if I select password protect whole website and type in a password, any website visitors will also need to enter that password in order to access the website. Any portfolio sites that are password protected from the start also will not be indexed by any search engines. To edit my URL, go over to settings, click on domain name at the top, and then I can edit my URL to be whatever I would like it to be. So for this example, I'm going to set it to Mary Metzger demo and apply. Great. So now you know the basics to creating your first website using Adobe Portfolio. Have fun creating.